Didier Drogba, born on March 11, 1978, Abidjan, Côte d'Ivoire. Ivory and professional football player, who was Côte d'Ivoire's all-time leader, in goals scored in international matches, and was twice named, the African Footballer of the Year, 2006, 2009. At age 5 Drogba, was sent to France, in the care of an uncle, a professional footballer. After three years, he returned home, only to go back to France, after three more years. At age 15, Drogba became an apprentice, with 2nd Division Le Valois, outside Paris. And then in 1997-98, he moved to Le Mans FC, where in his second season, he signed as a professional. In January 2002, Drogba joined top division Gingamp, tallying 17 goals, in 34 league games. This success, prompted a 2003 trade to Olympique de Marseille, where he scored 19 goals, in 35 domestic matches and an additional 11 goals, in European play. As the club reached the 2004 UEFA Cup Final, where it lost 2-0, to Valencia of Spain. Drogba moved to England's Chelsea FC, in 2004, in a trade from Marseille. Though Chelsea won its first Premier League Championship in 50 years the following season, its new centre-forward was inconsistent. Drogba was quick, alert, and supremely confident, in his own ability, though he showed a tendency, to a quick temper in matches. Even in his second season, when Chelsea's title was successfully defended, fan appreciation was still muted. Yet by the end of the 2006-07 season, when Chelsea failed in its attempt to take a third, straight league championship, Drogba had won over most of the skeptical Chelsea fans. By being the league's top scorer, with 20 goals, and by finishing the season, with an overall tally of 33 goals. In addition, he was the key player in Chelsea's winning, both the Football Association, FAR, Cup, and Carling Cup trophies that season, as he scored the club's only goals. Drogba helped lead Chelsea to the 2008 Champions League final, where he once again earned fan ire by slapping an opposing player and getting sent off in a match. That Chelsea ultimately lost to Manchester United by one penalty kick. In 2009, he earned a measure of redemption as Chelsea won its second FAR Cup with Drogba on the squad. The following year, Chelsea won both the FAR Cup, and the Premier League title, with Drogba leading the league in goals, 29 for the season. In the 2012, Champions League final, he scored Chelsea's lone regulation goal, and the winning extra time penalty kick, to guide Chelsea, past Bayern Munich, and capture the team's first European club championship. In the following off-season, Drogba signed with the Chinese club Shanghai Shenhua, but he played only 11 matches, with the team before returning to European football. As a member of Istanbul's Galatasaray, in January 2013, he helped Galatasaray, win the Turkish First Division Championship, in his inaugural season with the team. In July 2014, he returned to Chelsea, on a one-year contract. The following year, he signed with the Montreal Impact of Major League Soccer, in North America. In 2017, he joined the Phoenix Rising of the Second Tier, United Soccer League, as both a player, and part owner. However, the following year, he retired from competitive play. Drogba, made his first international appearance, for Côte d'Ivoire in 2002. In 2006, he captained Côte d'Ivoire, to the African Cup of Nations final match, where, the team lost to Egypt, on penalty kicks. His performance in the qualifying matches, for the 2006 World Cup was key, 
to Drogba's winning that year's African Footballer of the Year award, as his nine goals in eight preliminary matches catapulted the Ivorians into the World Cup for the first time. Drogba led Cote d'Ivoire to a fourth place finish in the 2008 Cup of Nations, and the team qualified for its second consecutive World Cup in 2010. In 2012, he captained his country to a runners-up, finish at the Cup of Nations, and helped Cote d'Ivoire qualify for the 2014 World Cup. His team missed out on advancing to the tournament's knockout stage for the first time by conceding a stoppage time goal on a penalty kick in its final group stage match. Shortly thereafter Drogba announced that he was retiring from international play. In 2011, Drogba's native Cote d'Ivoire underwent civil war following a disputed presidential election, and in its aftermath Drogba was appointed to an 11-member truth and reconciliation commission established to ease the country's divide. The commission submitted a final report in 2014. Drogba was involved in philanthropic causes, and in 2007, he established the Didier Drogba Foundation.